for unboxing the Geek Gear December box. I'm really excited. Obviously, the festive box was November's box, so, and I cannot remember what the hints were. I can remember seeing them, but I can't remember what hints they were, but more of a surprise for me. So if you want to see, just as much as I do, what's inside December's box, then keep on watching. And if this is the first time you see my face, hello and welcome to my channel. If you would like to become a Potter Puppet with us, please get that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a video. All my social medias are linked in the description of this video. Go see what I'm up to on those. And guys, I am trying my hardest to get to my next big milestone of 2,000 subscribers. So I'd really appreciate you considering uh, hitting that subscribe button. And also I would leak, like, leak, 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 like, like like to give a massive thank you to all my patreons they help me keep this channel running just that little bit more if you'd like to know any more about patreon that is also linked in the description of this video go check it out if you think it's for you then come join us let's open december's box okay i'll let you have the first look guys you ready is it good is it good oh i see color let's put the box down we're gonna pull the What's on top out first? What's on top out first? Did that come out right? The t-shirt. Let's have a look. I'll let you see it first. You ready? What do we think? Oh, what have we here? Oh, it's Dumbledore's office. Okay, I'm feeling this. This is really nice. I do really like that. It's nice and vibrant. You can definitely tell it's Dumbledore's office. We don't have a lot to do with Dumbledore's office and we've never had anything like this on a t-shirt so I really like that. That is really, really nice. Everything is where it should be. That's really nice. Is Fox in there? No, Fox isn't in there but that's fine. He wasn't there all the time, was he? But yeah, I really like that t-shirt. It's different and it's nice and it's definitely something I would wear. Very good. Well done, a geek gear. Right. I'm in the box. Okay, right, I can feel bubble wrap. So we've got, oh, we've got some bubble wrap. I've just seen what's on the box. I'm not going to try and show you through the bubble wrap because you won't see it. But on the front here, we've got a picture of what looks to be Slughorn's hourglass. I want that replica so bad, you know, that proper Noble Collection replica. So if this is a miniature, I'm going to be rather excited. I'm not even going to look. We're just going to pull it out this bubble wrap. that is amazing look at it just appreciate it for one second oh that is nice that oh geek yeah that is amazing just look one more guys just just look at it look at the sand flowing if you can you see i'm trying to get at the right angle i think you can see that is absolutely beautiful i am Geek Gear, you keep making me speechless and it's not like me because I just don't shut up all the, like normally. I love it. And the sand is like glittery green. This video is going to be like 20 minutes about Slughorn's Hourglass, isn't it? I love it. Okay, we're going to put that down. We're going to put it down now. Oh, wow. The t-shirt's great. And the, um, the Slughorn's Hourglass. Right, what we got now? What is this? Okay, we've got a pin badge. I'm not quite sure. I don't know if I'm having a moment or what, but let's have a look. I'm not sure what that represents. It's a very nice pin badge. It's a big pin badge. I'm not quite sure. Is it me? Is it something to do with... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We'll have a look at the cheat sheet at the end and we'll see what the pin badge is all about. It's probably me just having a moment. Right. There's a lot of boxes. I like this. Okay, wow. We had this is obviously a chess piece. We haven't had a chess piece for a while. So let's have a look which chess piece we've got. My chess pieces aren't out on display at the minute because um I've got quite a lot going on. As you can see, we do need a new area, so it will be put into a new area, but yeah. Okay, I am not even gonna guess. Is it Bishop? Is it the Bishop? Who are you? 
the cheat sheet will tell us at the end who that is. You're probably sat there screaming what it is at me or saying, yes, you're right, it's the bishop. But I am rubbish, absolutely rubbish with naming chess pieces. But we'll have a look, obviously, at the cheat sheet at the end. But all, all I know is I am happy with that we have another piece. Because, um, yeah, it's really nice. It's quite, is it heavier than the other ones? I don't know. We haven't had one for a while, so I'm not quite sure. But it's got a nice weight to it anyway. It's really nicely made. Look at the back. That is really nice. But yeah, we have another chess piece. Geek Gear, I've asked this before, but are we going to get a chess board at the end of it for all these chess pieces to display? That would be cool. That would be cool. Geek Gear, tell us. Okay. Oh, we've got a scratch card. Let's have a quick scratch. Let's have scratch. Uh, no win. Better look next time. Okay. Back in the box. Okay, what's this? Oh no, oh, 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 we've got a wand, we've got a wand, hang on. Right, okay, so we have, is this? Right, so we've got some lemons. The box is nice. They have done, it is, it's another shop sign. Which one's this one? Sherbet lemon, it's one of them, is it not sandwich boards? Because they what you wear, but you know what I mean? We've got another one. My other one is on my shelf. Um, this is going next to it. How cool is that? I'm loving these little shop sign boards. They're really, really cool. It's the same on the back and they're made so well. Is it like a resin? Oh, it's another one to go. What was the other one? Pumpkin pasties. Hang on, I'll show you the other one. Sorry about my bum. Okay. So there's the other one. So we've got pumpkin pasties and we've got the sherbet lemon. I think I might need to do an updated tour on the chocolate frog. It on the chocolate frog on the honey jute shelf do you know what should we show you now so here is the honey jute shelf obviously i've just put the pumpkin pasties board back on there i haven't put the lemon one on yet i'm not going to put it on yet because i'll forget we got it out of the box because we need to pick a favorite at the end but yeah that's pretty full on my honey jute shelf now but i absolutely love it okay hand is back in the box i'm gonna have to have a look actually okay we're gonna we're gonna pull the wand out We've got a wand card, I'm not going to look at that. Oh, you've got it in the wand! Oh, this is very pretty. Oh, I like this. Oh, I do. This is really nice. Look at the swirls. Oh, look at the end there. It's like icicles at the end. And then we've got... What is it? It look, kind of looks like a crown to me. Do you know what I mean? But it's really nice, really detailed. It's nice, it's different as well. I've not seen anything like this. That is really nice. Let's have a look at the card, see what it says. So it's a regalia wand, if that's how you see it. Length 13 and 3 quarter inches. Core, ruby dust and wood is ebony. So that that's really nice. I like that. I love the weight of Geek Gear's wands. They're nice. They're not too heavy. They're not too light. They are really, really nice. And that is absolutely gorgeous. I do love a Geek Gear wand. But look at it. I'll give you a look. So pretty. Okay, the next thing I can... I'm going to have to look. Okay, oh, the charm. We've got the charm. I ain't got my bracelet on. <gasps> oh, I love the charm. Oh, this is nice. Hang on, I'll get it out of the packet. Add to the suspense for you guys. But you won't see it because of the studio light. We have, this is really nice, we've got a flying key. How cute is that? Look at it! Focus on the key. That is so lovely. Let me turn it round. I really, really, really like that. <sighs> it's downstairs. I was going to do it now. That is so cute. I absolutely love that. We all love a flying key. That is such a lovely little charm. I love it! Okay, what have we got left in here? We've got wiggly worms and then we've got... We haven't got a cheat sheet. There's no cheat sheet. So I am not going to know what that pin badge means. If anyone knows, let me know in the comments. And like I said, I don't... Let me have another look. No, I don't, it's not... Nothing's clicking. What is it? I love it. What is it? What is it, guys? And what is that chess piece? Because that's going to bug me now. But yeah, there's no cheat sheet whatsoever. But this is the print. So we have got Luna Lovegood. We've got her name here in like bubble writing, I call it. And there she is looking her spectra specs with her quibbler in hand. I love, 
Luna so much. That's it guys, everything has been unboxed. Favourite straight away is going to have to be this. This is absolutely beautiful. I am so happy with this. I really, really am. Honestly, that is gorgeous. We're going to put this straight. We're going to put it here. I think it, what do you think guys? Just for now. I think that looks really cool there. We'll leave that there. But that is definitely my favourite item. This box, I will say was strong for me. For me. I do think this was strong. I do want to know who that is and what this represents. I am really, I like it, but I'm not, that's a, is it meant to be a wand? It's not dumb, something to do with Dumbledore's army. You're probably laughing at me, aren't you? Probably laughing at me. I love the charm. Absolutely gorgeous little flying key charm that will go straight on my bracelet when I get downstairs. Yeah, I honestly love this box and I love it when we get a wand absolutely love it but yeah what did you think to this box guys as a whole did you get december's box i will link geek gear's website as always in the description so you can go check them out um if you do enjoy watching these unboxings and you've been thinking about it for a while go subscribe to them and unbox with me every month i don't actually have a least favorite i haven't had a least favorite for a while now i do find that geek gear have i mean i've always liked their boxes um, but they really seem to have really outdone themselves just recently. And I'm really, really loving their boxes. See, I haven't got a least favourite. I really can't pick one. Favourite's definitely Slugorn's Hourglass. Um, but I do genuinely love everything in this box. Oh, I love it. But do you have a least favourite item from this box? Do you have a favourite? Talk to me in the comments and let me know what you think. But yeah, that is the end of the video, guys. Please give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it because it helps me more than you know. And I will speak to you in my next video. Bye, Puzzle Puppets.